Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a wild one for you. We're diving into the 15 strangest things ever found during an airport search. So buckle up because we're about to take off on a journey through the weirdest things ever found in airport security. Make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on the craziness. Okay guys, imagine this. You're in line at airport security just trying to make it to your flight on time. Suddenly, BOOM! The TSA agents freak out. Why? Because some genius decided to bring a live snake in their carry-on luggage. We're talking about a full-on constrictor. This thing was big enough to like, squeeze a watermelon. Can you imagine the chaos? People screaming, running for their lives while this snake just slithers along the conveyor belt like it's no big deal. The best part? The guy actually tried to argue with the TSA agents about it. He was all like, but he's harmless. He wouldn't hurt a fly. Yeah, right, buddy. All right, next up, we've got a real head scratcher. Literally. You know how they say you can't take it with you? Well, this next passenger took that to a whole new level. They decided to bring a human skull in their checked bag. Yeah, you heard me right. A skull, like the thing that your brain lives in. Can you even imagine the thought process behind that decision? Imagine the baggage handlers just casually tossing this suitcase onto the plane, totally unaware that they're carrying around someone's great-great-grandpappy, the sheer surprise they must have felt when they found out. Turns out, it was just some dude who bought the skull as a souvenir in another country. Who even thinks of buying a skull as a keepsake? Can you imagine the interrogation? The questions must have been wild. Sir, we found a human skull in your luggage. Oh yeah, that. It's Bob. He's from my trip to, uh, Cleveland. Just a little memento, you know? Hold on to your hats, folks, because this next one is a real bomb. We're talking about a passenger who tried to bring a grenade through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. A grenade. The kind that goes boom. I can't even imagine the look on the TSA agent's face when they saw that thing pop up on the x-ray screen. Talk about a bad day at work. I bet they hit the emergency button so fast their finger broke. The whole terminal probably went into panic mode. But here's the kicker. It turned out to be a replica grenade. Yeah, the passenger was just some clueless tourist who thought it would be a cool souvenir. Chapter 4, Eels. Really? Alright folks, get ready for this one because it's a real slippery situation. You won't believe what happened at the airport this time. We're talking about a passenger who was caught trying to smuggle a whole bag of eels through airport security. Yes, you heard that right, a bag full of live eels. Yeah, you heard me right. Eels. Those slippery, wriggly creatures that you usually find in the ocean not in someone's carry-on luggage. Those slimy, snake-like fish that live in the ocean. Imagine the surprise on the faces of the TSA agents when they saw that. I don't know what's more bizarre, the fact that someone tried to bring eels on a plane or the fact that they thought they could get away with it. It's like something out of a comedy sketch. The passenger tried to explain that the eels were a special delicacy from his hometown, and he was bringing them back as a gift for his family. Yeah, right buddy. Can you imagine the look on his family's faces? Here mom, I got you these lovely eels for your birthday. Just what every mother dreams of, right? Hope you like the smell of fish in despair. This has to be one of the strangest things ever attempted at airport security. Chapter 5, Sword Al Security Threat. Hold on to your katanas, folks, because this next story is straight out of feudal Japan. Imagine the ancient warriors, the honor, the tradition, and now fast forward to modern times. We're talking about a passenger who thought it would be a good idea to bring a samurai sword through airport security. Yes, you heard that right, a full-on samurai sword at an airport. Yeah, you heard me right. This wasn't a small pocket knife or a souvenir, it was a full-sized, razor-sharp samurai sword. A full-on, razor-sharp samurai sword, the kind that could slice through almost anything with ease. I'm talking about the kind of sword that could slice a watermelon in half with one swift motion. Imagine the precision and the power behind that blade. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. Maybe they thought it was a cool idea or perhaps they were just oblivious to the rules. Maybe they were trying to start a new trend airport cosplay? Who knows, maybe they were just a huge fan of samurai culture. I can only imagine the look on the TSA agent's face when that thing showed up on the x-ray screen. It must have been quite a shock. The passenger tried to explain that the sword was a family heirloom and he was just bringing it back from a trip to Japan. Yeah, okay buddy, but rules are rules and even family heirlooms have to go through proper channels. Chapter 6. Dead on Arrival. Literally, 
All right, folks, this next story is not for the faint of heart. We're talking about a passenger who tried to bring a dead body through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. Apparently, the passenger was trying to transport the body of a relative back to their home country for burial. The passenger apparently had all the necessary paperwork and permits, but still, I mean, who wants to be on a plane with a dead body? Chapter 7. Feathered friend or feathery foe, get ready to ruffle some feathers folks because this next story is for the birds. We're talking about a passenger who tried to sneak a live parrot through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. A parrot. This little feathered friend was tucked away in the passenger's coat just minding its own business. As the passenger was going through the metal detector, the parrot started squawking its little head off. The TSA agents were probably like, what the heck is that racket? Chapter 8. Love is in the air. Port, get ready to blush folks because this next story is a little bit awkward. We're talking about a passenger who set off the metal detector at airport security because they were wearing a chastity belt. Yeah, you heard me right, a chastity belt. I don't know what's more surprising, the fact that someone wore a chastity belt to the airport, or the fact that they thought they could get away with it. The passenger was probably mortified. I bet they were sweating bullets trying to explain this one to the TSA agents. Chapter 9. Bugging out at security. Get ready to be creeped out, folks, because this next story is not for the squeamish. We're talking about a passenger who was caught trying to smuggle a whole bag of insects through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. Insects! I'm talking about spiders, beetles, cockroaches, you name it. This passenger had a whole entomological collection in their luggage. The passenger tried to explain that they were a scientist and they needed the insects for research purposes. Yeah, right, buddy. Chapter 10. Hold the chainsaw, sir. All right, folks, this next story is a real head scratcher. We're talking about a passenger who tried to bring a chainsaw through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. A chainsaw, the kind you use to cut down trees. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. The passenger tried to explain that he was a lumberjack and he needed the chainsaw for work. Yeah, okay, buddy. Chapter 11. Santastic Security Breach. Get ready to be baffled folks because this next story is truly bizarre. We're talking about a passenger who was caught trying to bring a whole bag of sand through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. Sand. The stuff you find at the beach. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. The passenger tried to explain that the sand was from a special beach and they were bringing it back as a souvenir. Yeah, okay buddy. Chapter 12. Chilling out at the airport. Literally. Get ready to be amazed, folks, because this next story is truly epic. We're talking about a passenger who tried to bring a full-sized refrigerator through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right, a full-sized refrigerator, the kind that holds your milk, eggs, and leftovers. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. The passenger tried to explain that they were moving and they didn't want to leave their refrigerator behind. Yeah, okay, buddy. Chapter 13. Wedding Dress distress get ready to say ah oh, folks because this next story is a real tearjerker we're talking about a bride who almost missed her wedding because her dress got lost at airport security yeah you heard me right her wedding dress the most important dress of her life apparently the bride had checked her dress in a special garment bag but somehow it got separated from her luggage luckily the tsa agents were able to track down the dress just in time the bride was so relieved she probably hugged the tsa agent who found it Chapter 14, Diamonds Are Forever. And so is this security breach. Get ready to be blinded by the bling, folks, because this next story is about a passenger who was caught trying to smuggle a bag of diamonds through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. Diamonds, the sparkly kind. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. The passenger tried to explain that the diamonds were fake and they were just costume jewelry. Yeah, okay, buddy. Chapter 15, Shall we go through security? Get ready to laugh, folks, because this next story is truly crustacean crazy. We're talking about a passenger who tried to bring a live lobster through airport security. Yeah, you heard me right. A live lobster. The kind you find in the ocean. I don't know what this passenger was thinking. The passenger tried to explain that the lobster was his pet, and he couldn't bear to be apart from it. Yeah, okay, buddy. I'm pretty sure most airlines have a strict no pets allowed policy when it comes to crustaceans. Outro, and there you have it folks, 
15 of the strangest things ever found during an airport search. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our crazy stories. Until next time, stay safe, stay weird, and we'll see you in the skies.